Hey guys, Danny here at Parte. So just wanted to check in with everyone and let them know kind of what our plans were over the holiday season and uh, making some things available out there. So here's our plan. So today is the 19th. Uh, as of the 22nd, which I believe is Wednesday, uh, we are going to open up uh, one cart within our website, and that is going to be sample packs for Daystar. It's actually our gray sample pack, so it'll be Daystar, Vega, and Vega Plus. Now, those will be selling for $20, and uh, that includes shipping. So, we will ship those out for folks because we've had a number of folks that have requested which screen do we believe would be best for them. And so, rather than us trying to quantify not only lumen count, but environmental lux and things like that, uh, we figured it's probably just best to go ahead and give people some samples so they could take a look for themselves. Now, what we'll do is we'll open that bin on the 22nd. We'll run that through the 26th. Okay, the day after Christmas, which is a Sunday, and we'll close that down. Now, we're going to offer 20 sample packs. If those sample packs run out before Sunday, then that's all we'll have available. Uh, but assuming that they don't, uh, we'll run it through Sunday, and then we'll close that out. We'll, we'll process those Monday and Tuesday of, of the week after Christmas, um, and then uh, make sure that those are shipped out to folks. Uh, as of that Thursday, the 29th, we will open our carts uh, so that folks can start to purchase uh, the Parte product line. So, <clears throat> here's things to, to consider. One, if you order one of the sample packs, you will not receive a tracking number. You'll get a, a notification sent to you that we've received your order. But we're not going to process it until the following Monday or Tuesday. And the reason for that is because it's the holidays, folks. <laughs> I'm going to be spending a good bit of time with the family. So you will not have a tracking number from us until it's actually handed over to USPS. And that's the way that we run all of our operations. So when you get a tracking number for us, you know that your package has already been delivered to USPS. We don't issue tracking numbers and labels uh, and then not deliver your stuff to USPS for a week or a week and a half. Uh, we don't operate that way. You'll get a tracking number when it's physically in the courier's hand. Uh, we come back home. We're literally seven minutes away here uh, from our post office. So whenever I get back, I enter those tracking numbers into the system and then it issues you a notification of your tracking number. Okay. Until that time, I do not have access to your funds. So I just want to clarify that for people because I know Kenneth Bird's been out there saying all kinds of suspicious stuff. But the truth is, is that we have no access to your money until we mark that fulfilled. Okay. That purchase has to be fulfilled. And the beauty of that is, is that when I have your tracking number, it's been handed to the courier. When I put your tracking number into the system, and then mark that fulfilled, you have peace of mind to know that it's actually with the courier and on its way to you. Okay, so that's the way that we're going to operate. Uh, I'll be talking more about uh, our processing and shipping whenever we get ready to open the carts. Uh, but for now, this will at least give folks an opportunity to get their hands on a few samples and see how it works for them. Um, now, I just want to say a few thank yous. Uh, now, you know, we, we purchased the uh, Final Phantom 21 from Crystal Edge Technologies. We did the review here. Uh, you saw just how well that did not go for the Final Phantom 21. And I'm not saying that to be disparaging. I'm just saying this is, you know, re realistically, I just saw this morning where another customer had purchased it and were upset. And what's Mr. Bird doing? He's berating the customer again. So you won't get that from us, folks. I'm just going to be honest. You're never going to get that from us. But that's just to show you that you have somebody out there who is selling. It's just as simple as this. They're selling very cheap exterior paints that they buy from Lowe's. Mix it with some paint thinner and put it out there on the market. There's no confusion as to whether or not this is a great product. It is not. Essentially, all you have is somebody who's trying to screw people out of money out there. He's been doing it for years. 
why I say thank you is thank you to the folks who participated in highlighting that fact. Because, you know, you just try to get the information out there so that people can see. I like the fact that everybody took a little different approach to it. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Um, I don't think I've seen Sonics yet, so be interested to see what Sonic does with it. But, you know, folks, it is what it is. I know that people don't like that statement, but it's actually one of my favorite because sometimes in this life, things just are what they are. Some things can be altered, some things can't, right? And the thing that can't be altered is that there's no way that you can take that product from Crystal Edge and make it a projection screen. It was never meant to be projection screen coating. It's a horrible projection screen coating. And I want to thank folks out there for taking the time to show that. So, thank you guys so much. Uh, for us, Ken, we're not afraid of you. We've never been afraid of you. We're never going to be afraid of you. You can't go where we're going. Don't know any other way to say it than that. You will eternally be stuck in your home because that's the only place that your screens ever look decent. Not even great. But they only look decent whenever you fake film them. Okay, you misrepresent what they actually look like. So, no, we're not afraid, Mr. Burden. We're not going to be afraid of you, ever. So, say what you want to, do your worst. No doubt one day you will get your hands on stuff and you'll do all kinds of inappropriate things with it to try to make it look bad. But, you know, we just don't care. It's just that easy. And the one thing you can't beat is a man who just don't give a damn. So, have fun. But for the rest of you guys, I'm wishing you a very Merry Christmas. Uh, we're looking forward to 2022. We got a lot of things planned, and I'm not saying that just to be hyperbolic. We do have a lot of things planned. Uh, Jason and I have been really, really busy making some plans on how we can make, because in 2022, early 2022 if possible, we're looking to create our own way to make a UST screen, sawtooth microstructure screen, uh, available for sale. So that is uh, something that we've got our eyes on, our focus on, and we're really excited about being able to become a real screen maker. These will be cast screens. Um, so just excited. Right now, we're just trying to make sure that we have the infrastructure in place to be able to support the orders. So we've got, you know, everything in place that we need for right now. Um, and we'll let people out there in the world be the judge of parte quality. All right. You guys take care. Uh, Merry, Merry, Merry Christmas to you. And I hope that uh, everybody has a safe and very happy holiday. You guys take care. Bye.